continuing with our discussion of microbiology, I'm here with James Beeves, our clinical product manager. James, especially in the clinic, there are some super bugs and some microbial threats that people are really focused on these days. Can you talk about the more innovative or products like that which we're selling for MRSA, MRSA? MRSA is hugely important uh, in the clinical setting globally. Uh, I think, in fact, in the US, it accounts for more deaths than, than AIDS. Uh, and in the ICU, um, around 60% of all staphylococcal infections are actually MRSA, so it's hugely significant. It's a resistant organism, a, a staph aureus, which typically forms part of the normal skin flora on you or I, on, on everyone around the globe. But when you move into a hospital environment and you expose those organisms to antibiotics, they can pick up resistant genes and can cause a lot of infections. They become difficult to treat with the antibiotics that we would normally use and mean that a patient that is infected is likely to have a much longer stay in hospital and can have lots of complications. So hospitals are looking to identify those patients that have these more, more dangerous MRSA strains. What we offer is uh, brilliant MRSA. It's a chromogenic agar plate, so it's very easy to use. It's the hospital would take a, a swab from, from the patient. That swab would then go down to the laboratory where they would take our prepared Petri dish, take the swab, inoculate the bacteria onto the plate and then incubate that. If there was an MRSA present, it would produce a series of blue colonies, blue dots if you like, right. on the surface of the agar. If there are blue dots, depending on where the patient is and where the infection is, they can apply decolonization treatment like muropyrinacin cream that mm -hmm. uh, can be used on the nose or some kind of chlorohexidine wash that would allow you to control the amount of MRSA that was on that patient and stop them uh, passing the infection on to themselves and to uh, surrounding patients. And because MRSA is such a global issue and such a big threat to healthcare, we've continued our R&D research and development pro uh, projects here to develop a Mark II Brilliant MRSA, which is even more accurate. Watch for more progress reports or visit thermoscientific.com.